Hi guys, this is Moi Bun. In this video, I will show you how to connect your Blendship embedded VRM model with VC Face. This method will use a face tracking tool called iFacial Mockup. This is a paid app that costs $7.99 once for all. You might need to save this video because it's pretty practical and you might need to look it up several times. With that said, let's get into the video. First of all, you'll need to start with VC Face. To prepare your iPhone and VC Face, you need to prepare on both ends of the device. And I'll start with preparing on PC the VC Face, then move on to the iPhone to connect your facial expression to VC Face. You might not need any actual camera, so feel free to choose a virtual camera, and then you start using this model. After your model is loaded, you need to first of all click on the mirror motion to go to settings, then general settings, and then you move down to iFacial Mockup, Face Mockup 3D, VTube Studio. Over here, you need to turn on the iPhone ARKit track receiver, and by the tracking app, you need to select on iFacial Mockup, and I will show you what you put in this IP a bit later. This IP is the number that you need to find on your phone. To find an IP number, you need to make sure that the phone that you're about to track is connected to your local Wi-Fi. Then you go to settings. And then in Wi-Fi, the Wi-Fi that you are connected to. And then you click on the little I on the right side. And then you will find a number that's called IP address. And the IP address that you find from your phone, you need to put in into this IP and then your PC end is pretty much prepared. Then on the iPhone side, when you open your iFacial mockup, you will see face recognition and there is a small gear on the top right corner of the app. You need to click on the gear and then you go into the settings. And over here, you just need to input your number from your destination IP address. So to find that destination IP address, you just need to go to your network and internet settings and by status, you click on properties. You need to input the number from the IPv4 address. Then you can see that my face is successfully linked with the iPhone iFacial mockup. If this video is helpful for you, please give it a like and leave a comment down below. If you have more suggestions or more tips to share, please leave a comment as well. And please subscribe to this channel for more videos like this and I really appreciate any support. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!